Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Cubing for Life, back with another video. Now, whenever I do an unboxing, vid unboxing video, it never uploads. So now, I'm gonna hopefully upload this one. And if not, I don't know how you can be seeing this, but yeah. Okay, what we have right here is a Diane Tangan M. It's supposed to be an extremely quiet cube and some Martian lube just to make it even more quiet. Let's see. This is very annoying. Except the satisfying noise of bubble wrap makes it less annoying. Who boxes their cubes in bubble wrap? Who does this? This is just pure evil. Okay. So sore? Okay, yes, yes. Scanning here. Okay. Let's open up this Diane cube. Oh, what? oh okay. Okay. The beauty. The cube. Hopefully it's not that greasy. Yep, this is very greasy. No, it's actually not. Corner fighting? Amazing. Oh wait, well this comes pre-lubed. Mm. Okay, yep, that is extremely greasy. Okay, um, here, I will be right back. Now, I'm gonna try something out. I think because the other videos, they didn't post because I had more than one clip in them. So, I'm gonna try not putting more than one clip. So, I'm just gonna get a cube real quick, and I'll be right back. I am back and I have a Yushin Little Magic. Now this cube is already fast, but let's see, does it even tell you how many drops to put in? No, it doesn't. Let's see, break. I'm just. I don't know like how many I'm supposed to put in, so I'm just going to put in uh, three. Three is a good number. Let's see, one. How do you go? One. Well, really? Lube is not gonna come out, will it? Okay, got two drops in. I'm hoping that that is enough. This is feeling pretty nice. Okay. Well, now back to the main thing about the video. The Diane cube. Whoa, whoa. This cube is amazing. That corner cutting. Okay. Wow. This is a very nice unboxing. And these cubes are extremely nice. Now I loop them. So.
a Martian move. Oh no, I just messed up. Uh, oh no, sorry guys. I just went to a Rubik's Cube competition. Now, I'm not going to post it, except something amazing happened. I got a 13 second solve for 3x3. Three 13 seconds. Also, for 2x2, two two, I got a 3 and a 4 second solve. Then I got a 5 and 5 plus 2 and 7, you know. But, yeah, in total, it, it was just an amazing comp. And I also made round 2 of 3x3. Three three. Except I had no chance of winning. But I did learn how to solve a Rubik's clock, and I might be unboxing one of those in the future. Anyways, goodbye.